Wow. My school is awesome. We're always doing cool stuff like this. Like, did you know that dragonflies have been around for 300 million years? I just learned that. Whoa. Us kids have minds like sponges. We're just waiting to soak up everything around us. We're naturally curious and love to dive in and figure out how things work. After all, it's what we're best at. You know, a true sign of intelligence is not knowledge, but imagination. I didn't say that. Albert did. Follow me. Of course, you can't see imagination, but you can see what happens when it's let out. You can explore anywhere you want. It'll take you places you only ever dreamed of. And help you meet new people from all over the world. Where do you live? Like my best friend Alice. She's from Australia. I think it's pretty early there, so she's probably sleeping. Sydney, Australia is 19 hours ahead of San Francisco, California. Local time is 5.30 a.m. Thought so. Thanks, Dot. That was Dot, my AI assistant. We've all got one. They go everywhere with us, helping us learn and explore. Hey, Millie. I know you're busy, but your history project on Madame Curie is due in 17 hours. I'll remind you again later. OK. I don't really know what I'd do without her. Where was I? Oh, yeah. Learning and exploring. Sometimes the answers aren't right there in front of you. You have to dig a little. Look at things in different ways. Because there's usually more than one way to solve a problem. Oh, wow. And guess what? There will always be problems to be solved. Luckily, we're really good at that. My teacher, Mrs. Garcia, says it's good to take everything at your own speed. And don't be afraid to get things wrong once in a while. After all, mistakes are proof that you're trying. She says, sometimes it just takes a little time before it all makes sense. I feel that way when it comes to math. But I am getting better, though. I've still got loads to learn and ways to go, because it takes a long time to get educated. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> but I know that one day, I'll be here, working, maybe even in a place like this. I don't really know what I want to be when I grow up. Perhaps that job doesn't even exist yet. Mrs. Garcia says that learning never really stops because life never stops teaching. That works for me, because I'll never want to stop learning. I mean, why would you? No one knows what the world will really look like when I grow up. Definitely something more amazing than we've even got now. No matter what though, I know that when it's my turn to help make the world work, I'll be ready. Hey, Millie. Hi, Mom. Hi, sweetie. How was school today? Awesome. Did you know that dragonflies have been around for 300 million years? Wow, I guess you'll learn something new every day. I know.